From Studio One at Broadcast Place, live local breaking news continues. We're joined once again by Jimmy Moore. He's the creator of the Live in La Vida Low Carb blog. It's this week's Spotlight blog on Sound Off South. Jimmy, welcome back. Thank you. I do want to show your pictures again, and as we do that, can you give us some of the best tips you found to start this journey of losing weight? Sure. You know, anybody that's wanting to lose weight, the best thing I tell them to do is find a plan that will work for you. If that's low carb, great. If it's low fat, great. Whatever you choose, just find a plan. Find a book about that plan. Read it through and through. Follow it exactly as the author prescribed it, and then do it for the rest of your life. And you've been doing this now for five years. Five almost. years. Mm -hmm. And you started at 410 pounds. Today you're at? I'm at 235 today. Which is amazing. Thank now, you. with your blog, tell me some of the features that you offer on your blog for people who are interested about lo learning more about weight loss. Sure. I mean, daily I write articles where I give tips and recipes and success stories and all the things that you know people would look for in a weight loss blog. I also have a podcast show where I interview people and guests, uh, expert guests, to get more information out there. So it's not just some guy that lost weight telling information, it's also you know expert advice that people can find. We do YouTube videos, um, I even have a chocolate bar that I created that's sugar-free, low-carb. Should have brought you one. Yeah, today. I would love to so. have one right now. <laughs> well, and you also have your book. Can you tell us a little bit about your Live in La Vida, if you want? Actually, sure. Let me see if I can. We hold it Thank up there. Thank you, Vanna. <laughs> They pay me to be Vanna. Yes, there you go. <laughs> now tell me, when did you write this book? I wrote that in 2005. It, I actually wrote it within months of losing my weight because I didn't want to forget what it was feeling like at, like at the time to have lost that weight. You know, now sometimes I go, well, what was that experience like? But that is the raw emotion of what my weight loss experience was about. Well, and to give our viewers some perspective, at, at your heaviest, I think you told me you were consuming 16 Cokes a day yes. and, and a box of Little De Debbie snacks at a at time. At least, yes. <laughs> it had to be hard to break that habit. What is that like? It, I, I mean, the first day I wanted to kill myself, it felt so bad. <laughs> and actually for the first week, it was kind of hard, the headaches and the withdrawal symptoms from the sugar. But once you get past that, once you push through that pain, Kelly, it's the best feeling in the world, and I have not come down from the euphoria of it since. You can tell, because every time I've talked to you in leading up to this interview, you've been excited about this topic. Mm -hmm. And I do want to say that this really, it is a serious matter for you. Yes. Because you told me obesity runs in your family, it does. and it even took your brother's life. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Sure. My brother, Kevin, is four years older than me. Uh, I should say was four years older than me. He died in October uh, last year. You know, and it's one of those things that he knew about what to do. He just chose not to do it. I chose to do it. He chose not to do it. And he paid the consequences of it. And now he's gone. Um, my mom had gastric bypass surgery. So, I mean, our whole family has kind of gone through different journeys of trying to get to the answer for, for us. You know, and, and thankfully my mom, you know, is still alive and still with us because of her choice. And I'm still alive because of my choice. It just didn't work out that way for Kevin. And so really your message is, this is life-saving. You need to take Absolutely. some steps to do it. Yes. All right. Well, Jimmy, thank you so much thank for you. being here today. We enjoyed it. And if you would like to check out the Spotlight blog, again, it's Live in La Vida Low Carb, and that is on the News 4 sponsored site, soundoffsouth.com. Look for the Spotlight box in the center of the page. While you're there, check out the links to the other blogs from the upstate and around the Carolinas. Remember, there's something for everybody.